Welcome to today's broadcast. No matter what kind of day you are having, please remember that God is big and He is good. He is bigger and better than you think. Bring to your mind what it's like to feel your way around a dark room, a room that you're completely unfamiliar with. You know there must be some way to turn on the lights so you can make sense of your surroundings, but until you find that switch, you just bounce from one object to another. You wouldn't even consider trying to learn to navigate that room in the dark. You would insist on first finding the light switch. But we do not insist on first finding the light switch before trying to navigate our way through our life here on this earth. No, we try to learn to navigate in the dark. And we treat this moving around in the dark as if it is faith. As long as we insist on associating faith in God with persuading God to do things for us, it is as if we are trying to make our way through life in the dark. When I stumble around in the dark, so to speak, all that comes out of my mouth is, God, I need, I need. If I'm hungry, it's, God, I need some food, as I search about for something to eat, hoping I'll grab human food instead of dog food. If I need to get out of a storm, it's, God, I need some shelter, as I run around looking for someplace dry, hoping I'll find a place of safety instead of a place of danger. Stumbling around in the dark, bouncing from one circumstance to another, crying out to God, I need, I need, is not faith. Faith is turning on the light switch so I can see what is true and what is not true. Faith is seeing what surrounds me in the light of truth. And the truth is that God knows what I need. We read in Luke 12, 28 through 32. If then God so clothes the grass, which today is in the field and tomorrow is thrown into the oven, how much more will he clothe you, O you of little faith? And do not seek what you should eat or what you should drink, nor have an anxious mind, for all these things the nations of the world seek after, and your Father knows that you need these things. But seek the kingdom of God, and all these things shall be added to you. Do not fear, little flock, for it is your Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. And your Father knows that you need these things is one of the most important principles you can ever learn. To get to the place where you know that you know that God knows you have need of all these things, to get there changes everything. For more, please visit GiveMeThatMountain.org and you have a wonderful day.